Hello, it's a real pleasure to be with you from West London, from Stamford Bridge. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical analysis is Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Chelsea up against Newcastle United. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Joe Linton. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Can he finish? He got a good palm on it. And this is how it looks for Chelsea. Edouard Mendy stands between the posts. Thiago Silva plays with Antonio Rudiger in central defence. N'Golo Conte starts alongside Jorginho in the centre of midfield. And operating an attack today is Romelu Lukaku. So the starting 11 for Newcastle United. Martin Dubravka is the goalkeeper. Alan Sam Maxima plays with Ryan Fraser in the wide areas. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. He's beaten his man. They really look at... Can they forge ahead? That is a tackle and a half. Getting in there to take it away. Well, Kai Havertz, a gifted, naturally left-footed player who can dominate any game. Stuart, what do you expect to see from him today? Well, Derek, he's certainly going to be the key player today. Oh, well, Stuart, a chance! Oh, terrific save from the keeper. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Let's see about the delivery. Clattered away. James. Lukaku. Perfect challenge. Struggling to keep the ball. Mount. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Well, they were very patient, but they no longer have the ball. Shelby. Longstaff. Chris Wood. Good visualisation and execution. No problems for the keeper. Mount. And got a Conte. Romelu Lukaku now. Lukaku. And can they prize them open now? Conte. Now Lukaku. Conte. Now Lukaku. Now just the tackle that was needed. Chris Wood, Longstaff, Wood with it, it's with Joe Linton, tackling and winning the ball to boot, and now passing it through, and they just let his opponent glide by, and denied by the keeper, impressive, Lukaku in position, it comes to nothing in the end, Conte now with Mount they could nudge in front excellent defending but the chance is still on well they've won possession back what can they do from here Lukaku and a goal to give them the lead they have their reward Well, as you can see, this was always coming. They've been piling on the pressure. It's a well-deserved goal.
Well, Newcastle United get the ball moving again. Can they come up with a response now? And continues his run. Well, possibilities in the centre. Doughty defending to win the ball back. James. Lukaku. And the flag does go up offside. Sam Maxima. Long stuff. Joel Linton. And he read it well. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. Mount. Good tackle. And so the first half draws to a close here in West London. So they get the ball rolling in the second half and Chelsea helping to build upon a largely positive first half showing. Lukaku. Opportunity here and a goal! They've increased their lead and they don't want to be throwing it away from here. Well, this is a brilliant strike, as you can see. He hits it with so much power, the keeper had no chance. Fantastic finish. So, 2-0 now. Shelby, Chris Wood, and Newcastle pushing forward with options available. But he took care of it defensively. Beautifully disguised ball. Oh, it was a close run thing, but the goalkeeper just got there first. Marcus Alonso, Lukaku in position. Oh, and he didn't miss by very much. Yeah, he adjusted his body so well there. It's a great piece of skill, and it probably deserved the goal. He continues his run. Shelby and he saw the situation developing well Chelsea have had so much possession as you can see they've passed it well their movement's been good and they've been well worth their lead could get even better here useful looking position you've got to say and a fine stop Conte and it might be Conte it for power from close range he might be regretting that now Substitution for and time for the change now Almiron. Throw ins given. Jorginho. Marcos Alonso. Alonso. 
Chance to cross. Kai Havertz. Oh, great defending. And a poor ball. Conte. That's how to blunt the edge of the opposing attack. Not to be advised giving the ball away in that position. Marcus Alonso. Really good challenge. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. Oh, they've lost it. And the body in the way. Could reduce the deficit. Terrific piece of anticipation. Havertz. Now Chelsea in a position of menace. Cuts it back. And a goal! If there were any remaining doubts, that will settle the issue. Well, here we can see it again. He's shown outstanding vision to find the perfect cutback. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. Well, the ball is moving again, and there's no getting away from it. Chelsea are really in the mood here. Ten minutes to go then. Might be able to get in behind the defence, but really sticking to the task defensively. Marcos Alonso. Newcastle come away with it. As clean as a whistle, that challenge. Joel Linton. And they keep the ball. Advantage Chelsea. Lukaku. But in the closing phase, and Stuart, Chelsea have been tremendous today. Well, what an excellent performance this has been. They've had complete... Oh, look at this, Stuart. An opportunity. That's a great stop. Well, his reflexes are so good there. That's a fantastic stop. Well, taking into account all the stoppages, three minutes to be added on. Lukaku. The referee spotted the infringement, and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. Substitution. And they're making a change. Coming off the pitch, number seven, John Linton, to be replaced by number 28, Joseph Willock. Full-time men, the referee's whistle, and it's a win for Chelsea. That's the big headline, Stuart. Well, Derek, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? Particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively and almost cutting through at will at times. The result never much in doubt, if I'm honest. But I think it's fair to say he'll be happy with his own contribution in this game, Stuart. Well, I have to say, that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent.